Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another reaction video and this went up a few days ago and originally I was going to do a reaction for it but I completely forgot uh, but now it's making the rounds again so might as well do it. Uh, this is Metal Gear Solid, the original 1998 intro, the classic one when he's like he's infiltrating the uh, ship uh, and this is the remake that someone made uh, in Unreal Engine 28 or something i don't know uh and supposedly it looks great so I, i'm i'm excited and it shows the potential of like a, a another milk or solid remake i guess because we already had twin snakes but you know maybe a a better version because i know a lot of people didn't really care for twin snakes when i played it, i thought it was fine i don't know i played it a long time ago though so let's uh let's let's take a look at this i don't think i ever beat twin snakes All right. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Man, the Metal Gear Solid music's great. Oh, it's so good. I've been really clamoring to get back into Metal Gear Solid Five. Hell yeah, my boy, my boy Hideo. Back when Hideo used to do stuff that was kind of comprehensible. <laughs> Because Death Stranding, I don't know what the fuck is going on half the time. <laughs> it looks awesome, don't get me wrong. I, I like that I can't tell what the hell's going on in it, but... Oh, wow. Alright. The nuclear weapons disposal facility on Shadow Camel. Moses Island in Alaska's Fox Archipelago was attacked and captured by Next Generation Special Forces, being led by members of Foxhound. <laughs> Looks really good. They're demanding that the government turn over the remains of Big Boss. And they say that if their demands are not met within 24 hours, they'll launch a nuclear weapon. We'll have two yeah. First, you'll rescue Dark Chief Donald Anderson and the president of Armstead, Kenneth Baker. Both are being held as hostages. This is old. This is the old audio, exactly. right? You're to investigate whether or not the terrorists have the ability to Can't make tell, a nuclear actually. strike. And stop them if they do. What's the insertion method? We'll approach the disposal facility by sub. Yeah. And then we'll launch a one-man SDV. Looks really good. After the SDV Holy gets shit. as close as it can. Oh Please announce this, Konami. If Konami announced they would do like a remake of Metal Gear Solid, I'd be on board. I'd totally be on board. Imagine like they I used a Phantom Pain engine. Uh, I mean, it could be kind of shitty because Hideo Kojima's not there, but I'd still play the shit out of it. I'm not going to lie. It would be better than Metal Gear Solid, that's for sure. Yeah. Sniper Wolf, a beautiful and deadly sharpshooter. <laughs> Decoy Octopus, what are we Master of Disguise. Vulcan Raven, Giant and Shaman. It's like a, it's like a menu in a and diner. <laughs> you got all, all these dishes. And a formidable gun mm, delicious Spider, villains. In charge of the mm. Foxhound Squad Leader, Liquid Snake. <laughs> Liquid Snake. The man with the same code name as you. Oh, punk. Oh, that twist later. I mean, yeah, I don't spoil it, but... You find out who Liquid Snake is, actually. It's really good. Yes, this is a top-secret black op. Don't expect any official support. Whew. I feel kind of silly that I, I re-watched because I didn't have enough time to... Was that it? No, I'm about to. Um, <laughs> before Mel Gear Solid 5, Shadow Moses. Yes. Yes, yes. Oh my god! Nice. Well done. Well done. Really good. Oh, they, they uh, credited the director of the movie. Nice. Jordan Vegat. Roberts? I don't know if that's how you pronounce his name. Jordan Roberts, so called. <laughs> Jordan. We're on a first name basis. Um, but what was I saying? Oh yeah, I feel kind of silly because I, I rewatched um, 
Because I never finished all of the Metal Gear Solid games. It's just, I play so many games. There's no way I can. I just, I, I don't know. But I never finished them all, so I wanted to get into Metal Gear Solid 5 with knowing all the information so I wasn't confused. I, I found out pretty shortly into my playthrough of Metal Gear Solid 5 that it really didn't matter because the story wasn't the main focus. But uh, it was still cool to be able to, like, Metal Gear Solid 4 I never played, so I didn't have enough time to play it, so I just, wa I just watched, like, a movie version of it, so they kept all the boss fights in there, but they made it a little bit more cinematic and stuff, so I got the, I got, I got the whole experience, and they kept all the, uh, the, um, the dialogue, uh, uh, what the hell is it called, transmissions, um, and all that stuff, so that was fun, but I, I beat Metal Gear Solid 1 when it first came out, I got, like, halfway through the second one, and then something happened where I stopped playing, I think, I think, it, like, something happened with my memory or something like that, and I was already far into it, and I was a kid, and I think something happened where the, just the memory card got, like, corrupted or something, so I said, screw it, Metal Gear Solid 3 I just never played, I, I, well, that's not true, I played on 3DS, I played about 5 hours of it on 3DS, and I stopped, but, um, yeah, so, that's cool. Now, Metal Gear Solid 1 is the only one I actually technically beat besides Metal Gear Solid 5. And I guess Metal Gear Rising, but that doesn't really count. But, um, actually, I beat Metal Gear Acid. There you go. <laughs> I don't remember anything about it besides it was kind of like a card game. But, uh, I beat it. There you go. It wasn't very long, if I remember. But, yeah, that was awesome. So, great job there. Really awesome. The uh, I'll put a link in the description, of course. But whenever I, I check out someone's, like, fan-made thing, I usually try to keep a link in the description. When it's, like, a trailer for a giant thing, then, you know. I mean, come on. Like, if the trailer for Halloween, do you need me to link it? I mean, everybody everybody knows where it is. Like, But for this, it might be harder to find. So, uh, go check it out for yourself. It was really cool. Very, very, very awesome. So, good job there, guys. Good shit.